Hi, this is Sophia Rose with Chalice Palace, and today I'm going to show you how to use flaming chalice cookie cutters to make cinnamon dough ornaments. You will need one cup of powdered cinnamon, one quarter cup to one half cup applesauce, and one half cup of glue. Blend them in the food processor until it forms a nice firm ball of dough. If the dough is too sticky, add some more cinnamon. If it's a little bit too dry, add a little bit more applesauce. Cover your dough with plastic wrap and let it sit for about an hour. And then you take a, about a third of your dough and roll it out. You want to make it flat first and then cover it with cinnamon so that it doesn't stick to your roller and then roll your piece out to about one quarter to one eighth inch thick. Use your large and mini flaming chalice cookie cutters to cut out as many ornaments as you can. Once you've done that, scoop up the bits of unused dough into a ball and you can use it again to cut more ornaments. Now take the straw and pierce a hole in the top of each flame. They're looking great and they're smelling even better. The next step is to dry the ornaments. You can put them on a cookie sheet or on a cookie drying rack. They'll both work fine. The main key is to keep turning them so that they don't curl up. And once they're dry, you can rub the edges a little bit to remove any loose bits of dough or cinnamon. You can even use a nail file if you'd like to really get in the corners around the base of the chalice or up around where the flame is connected to the bowl of the chalice right in there. Your ornaments can take anywhere from 12 to 24 hours to fully dry. The next step is to add the string. I'm using an 8 inch piece of embroidery floss. First fold it in half and then tie the two ends together. And then take the other end where the fold is and gently guide that through the hole in the flame. and then pull it through the, to the back. And now you're going to make a loop there and stick the end, the tied end, through the loop and pull. That's called a half hitch knot. And then you can open the string and there's plenty of room to support it onto the um, tree or if you're tying it to a package or something. There it is. A nice little ornament. And they smell so wonderful. If you are interested in purchasing flaming chalice cookie cutters, you may find them on chalicepalace.com. That's C H A L. I C E P A L A C E dot com. 
You can also find us on Facebook.